What's up guys? Hey, just checking some comments on my last video. Yeah, I know the fucking seat pillion's backwards. I, I well, actually I didn't know it. I never paid any attention to it, but I, it has been fixed. So it is no longer backwards. So I appreciate all you guys letting me know that. Uh, didn't even notice it, but it has been fixed. Just FYI. Uh, a lot of you guys have been commenting on a walk around. Uh, I have some parts I put on the bike. Uh, so let's go out and take a look at it. I do have detailed uh, install and review videos coming on all this stuff. It's not a lot, but it, a little bit has filtered in. So it's kind of nice out. I'm not going to ride, but let's just go out in the driveway. I'll do a quick and dirty walk around with the GoPro, and you guys can see what changes have been made to the 2021 Street Bop. So let's go do that. So, all right, guys, you guys have been requesting a walk around. It's going to be down and dirty, but we're going to do it. Uh, First thing you can see right off the bat is I added the Memphis Shades Road Warrior fairing, which I absolutely love. Uh, they're great fairings. They work really well. I am wanting to do a custom paint job on it. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. I kind of want it to match. Something to go along with the tank would be pretty cool. So if you guys have any ideas, hit me up in the comments below. I'd appreciate it. Uh, another thing I've done so far is uh, Pro Beams by Custom Dynamics. Uh, I added them on the front. And on the rear, we have the Pro Beam uh, rear brakes and blinkers installed. And if you guys could tell right off the bat, I did a custom Saddleman knuckle seat with the orange stitching to kind of match the graphics on the bike, which I really dig. That seat turned out really great, and Saddleman makes some pretty cool stuff. Uh, there, the pillion has been fixed. I appreciate all you guys letting me know that it was on backwards. I didn't even notice it when I picked it up, but... I am trying to find something to match the Saddleman. Unfortunately, they really don't, Saddleman really doesn't have anything, uh, but I'm working on that. Hopefully I can find something that'll work out. I do have an exhaust and a new air cleaner by s and and I can't put that on until I find a tuner. Uh, really the only tuner that's available right now is a Harley tuner, and I'm really kind of holding out for the FP3. Strictly because, not that the Harley tuner is bad, but I'm a Mac guy, so, I'd have to actually buy a PC, you know, laptop to get it to work. And I really just don't want to invest that type of money when I can just wait a little bit and get an FP3 and do it with my phone. So, yeah, those are kind of the changes that have been made so far. I want to give a big thanks to Memphis Shades, Custom Dynamics, Saddleman, and s, &S for helping me out with all these parts so I can get them on here and show them to you guys. I do have detailed uh, videos coming out on everything as far as install and reviews and whatnot. So stay tuned. But a lot of you guys have been requesting a walk around. So I thought I would kind of do that today since it was nice out. Still a little chilly, but it's not too bad standing out here in the driveway. So for you guys that watched my other video, you know that I traded in my 18 Slim on this 2021 Street Bob. Uh, real quick, for you guys that aren't familiar with it, the 21... Street Bob had a big change, which was the 114 motor and some the paint and graphics. Everything else is pretty much exactly the same as the previous years. Uh, the 114 is, it's a peppy bike. It's a lot of fun to ride. I haven't got a lot of miles on it yet because of the weather, but hopefully soon we'll be able to get out and actually put some miles on it. From what I have ridden it, Fun bike, big sportster really, uh, feels a lot like a sporty, just a whole hell of a lot faster. So I really dig it. Uh, I think it was a good change for me. This is kind of more my style of bike and I am really digging it. So that's cool. A uh, couple of the cool things that I've noticed, I mean, Harley did a really good job on some of the badging. So you can tell on the air cleaner, 114 badging, which is pretty cool. I really like that. and. They didn't give me a really generic derby cover this time. You actually have a 114 derby cover, which was pretty cool. I think I'll actually keep that. Uh, there are going to be some other changes. This is just what I've got going now. So a lot of you guys have been requesting this. So I thought I'd go ahead and knock it out. So there you go, guys. Quick, dirty walk around of the 2021 Street Bob. If you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I guess I've wasted enough of your time today, so I appreciate you guys tuning in and let me waste your time. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. It should be right over there somewhere. I sure would appreciate it. Like always, guys, ride safe and be careful out there. Till next time. Later.